final day in Morocco. A bittersweet goodbye to a place I adore, the hospitality I have received, the food and culture I have loved will stay with me forever as I bid farewell to this land so clever. My heart is heavy with sadness, but I am grateful for the memories I have had. The warmth of the people, the beauty of the land will stay with me always as I leave this place with a heavy heart and a smile on my face. We are currently beneath Mosque Hassan here in Casablanca in a beautiful spa area. We've got the jacuzzi and all the different power jets of water that you use to massage your body under the biggest mosque in Morocco as well. We're going to get involved and see what's going on here. I can't believe they've built something so major and we've got it to ourselves. I don't understand why people don't come visit Morocco more. We've got these paths to ourselves. This is incredible. That place just stands out. I feel like a new person. I'm changed today. La Bosch, Moroccan steaks. The beef is the best. We're at a very special place here in Casablanca. Got some incredible artwork behind me. We were put up here after what was a special Qatar World Cup. And there isn't just Hakimi. We've got the manager, Red Ragri, Bono, the goalkeeper, who started at Wydad Casablanca and is now one of the best goalkeepers in the world of football. What a journey at the World Cup and it's so nice to see these sights in Casablanca. The sun's come out before the Club World Cup final. Let's play some golf. Swings, a few misses, we won't get into it, but now it's time for a traditional Moroccan Arabic style lunch. Oh wow, thank you so much. It's Friday, so we're gonna have some traditional Moroccan food. I've got the chicken tagine, look at this. It's got lovely sauce on it. We're doing things properly here in Morocco. The food looks incredible. People here, they go to the mosque and then they enjoy it with their family and friends. And we're gonna do that now. Chicken tagine review so tender, so delicious. Thank you, Morocco, for making great cuisine. These guys made the best lunch. Loved it. This Friday, we're enjoying it. The football tomorrow, let's move on. We have currently got the Flamengo team staying with us. They just had lunch. They've got their third place match to play tomorrow. Whilst we're going to the final, which is happening in this city, they'll be getting on a train or a coach to Tonjia, because that's the new location in the city. Here we go, our last day in Morocco. I can't believe we're coming to an end. So it's time to set the highest like target I've ever done. 50,000 likes is what I want because it's my final video in Morocco. Let's try and break the like target, the biggest one on my YouTube channel to show how powerful this Moroccan fan base is. This restaurant is where all the Madridsters in Morocco come pre-match. Madrid, okay. Madrid. Madrid, of course. Tell me you're a Widad and Real Madrid. Yeah, I wanted the Real Madrid and Widad in the final, but sadly uh, we did lose. Why are you so confident? Yeah, because it's Real Madrid, the greatest yeah. club in the history of football. They predict 3 1, like uh, like we said uh, earlier. It's yeah. such a Moroccan Real Madrid fan base. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A yeah. big, big Moroccan fan base. We did a big tifo in the last game. And there's it a massive the... connection with Morocco yeah. and Spain. Madridsters bar complete. We've made it to the stadium about two and a half hours till kickoff. Very excited. I've got my Morocco flag on. The connection I've had with Moroccans is probably the best of any nationality, than any fan base. And I've been to a lot of places across the world. Are you going to beat Real Madrid today? Do you believe? I, I believe in my team. Do you have a good feeling today? You yeah. feel it in your heart? That, that's why I came to just uh, to the stands today. Three, three hours ago, I came. I think it's going out. Yeah. Four, two, three, Benzema. Karim Benzema. Karim and Valverde. Today, Benzema proves why he's the best football player in the world. Who's going to win today? Real Madrid. Three, one. Yeah. I guess. Thank you so much. Come on, Oti boy. Past the first ticket barriers, starting to feel a little bit more emotional. 
my final day in Morocco. I'm not supporting Real Madrid or Al Halal. Of course, I like Madrid. I'm always bringing them luck in competitions and finals. But today, it's all about Morocco. They've held a great tournament and I'm sure one final brilliant showing. 3-0. 3-0? I think so. Yeah. Three zero. Yeah. Three zero. Yeah. Yeah. Benzema. Benzema. Vini and uh, Rodrigo. We're into the stadium one hour before kickoff. We're about to see the lineups, but let me give you some detail on the game. Al Hilal become the first club from Saudi Arabia to reach a Club World Cup final, creating a heated night in Rabat facing the kings of this competition, four-time winners Real Madrid. It was even boss Carlo Ancelotti who steered Real Madrid to the first win in 2014 and still here today. But Asia will be tuning in as Al Hilal could write history, the first Asian club to lift this golden trophy. So it's anyone's for the taking, but Los Blancos high favourites, but the Saudis are not going to give an easy. Now you're done with the details. It's all kicked off here, pitches everywhere, we love it! This is utter carnage. We've seen the teams Real Madrid have gone full throttle. No more Mallorca howlers. Al Hilal Ultras with the one flare. Two flares. Two flares. Making some appearance here on the opposite side of the stadium. Building a bit of noise here just before we see the first kick of the game. Spaniards, the Los Blancos over there. 
and everyone's together. It doesn't matter what country you're from, I'm English, they're Spanish, and there's Morkins. Everyone's singing together, making noise, having a good time, and that's what football does, it brings everybody together. And I've realised this tournament has been a really good one. I think they're going to go penalties. I've come from England, you come from Brussels. Exactly, yes, just for uh, this competition. I like Real Madrid, my big hurt. from Luka Modric, Champions League last year. They're about to make it five times. Campeones, Madridsters are dominant in all of football right now. It's not. I don't see an offside there, my friend. I don't mind. True winner of this match is Morocco for holding a great event. I can't believe we're leaving. Soon to be in the hands of the team singing. Okay. Can, I, can I just give a mention to this guy? I would honestly say the best player this tournament. The most that stood out to me. 5-3, it looks like it's going to end at full time. It's been a great game. Full time here. Oh, Real Madrid, the crown, Club World Cup champions. As a tournament here in Morocco comes to an end. Leaving the stadium for one final time. Thank you to everybody that supported me on this incredible journey. We've accumulated millions of viewers from all around the world. We've combined so many cultures. I've made so many new friends. It won't be long until I come back from Morocco. Casablanca Derby, I will return for AFCON 2024. The Morocco journey comes to an end. Let's end it with 50,000 likes. It's been a pleasure. Bye-bye.